guys, Jesse Dayton down here in Austin, Texas, talking about sick riffs. Um, yeah, I wanted to do this song that I think has a sick riff to it that I wrote called Hurtin' Behind the Pine Curtain, and it did well for us. It's kind of got this 70s white trash rock and roll kind of redneck rock vibe to it. Um, where it's just basically like overdriven twang. And uh, anyway, the riff is... <laughs> take a guitar that's tuned to 440 and I tune the E string down to a D string to a drop D where these two are the same and then I do a pull off off of the third fret on the D string so I hit that low one bump. Because the guitar is tuned down, the E strings tuned down to a D, so all this moved down. So this would be a G. So I'm hitting B F. But it's off of the third fret because it's a D, a D instead of an E. So it's basically. called The Outsider that we recorded uh, all over the United States while we were on tour. We recorded that in Denver or somewhere in Colorado, the studio where Joe Walsh was working. And I wanted to go there because I'm a huge Joe Walsh fan. But anyway, uh, I use this guitar, which is made by my friend Jason at Blast Cult in London. Uh, but the guitar was actually made in California. Um, and then I plug straight into the Orange Trim Lord 30. So I have no pedals right now. It's just crank, amps cranked as shit just to keep it nasty and dirty. And um, yeah, when I recorded it, I used a 66 Reverb Blackface uh, Super Reverb amp, a Fender, and just cranked it up. But I've, I'm using this Orange amp now um, because it's just newer and built better and not as delicate and it's road worthy. So as you can hear, it sounds really cool. And uh, I hope you guys dug this. Uh, hope to see you on the tour after the apocalypse is over and stay safe, all right? There you go. <laughs>